for today is based on meta genomic sequencing which have become extremely famous these days i am sure all of you have heard about genome sequencing right um what is meta genomic sequencing uh exactly means uh, let me try to explain this to you in a simple terms as possible so when there is a new virus that comes up we have to develop a vaccine against the advice or medicine against that virus we have to first understand the structure of that virus how is it made up and so what we do is we have to identify how exactly are they made and what are the building components of that virus uh, in simple terms this is called genome sequencing uh. now viruses are not that easier uh, viruses bacteria they are not uh, that easy to just dissect you can't just take up and break them open up and even see what is inside or it requires a lot of high scale sophisticated technique to go ahead and see whether we can identify the exact sequencing because only when you identify the exact sequences of the structure you can make a vaccine against it remember even today we see uh, new stories that a new variant of covid-19 has come up when you say new variant what do you mean by that new variant means a variant of that virus with a slight change in the structure uh, ch- the change in the genomic structure so this is where the genome se- genome sequencing is extremely important it is considered mainly as a first step to fight against any new virus any a new micro because only only then you can develop a vaccine or medicine against uh, against it this is an emergent technology in fact this is why we are able to break all the records as a world and brings a covid-19 vaccine with a few months if we look at any diseases that have happened earlier on uh, average developing a vaccine took close to 10 years on an average there have been a many vaccine developed even more than 10 years later the disease came coming uh, coming up but with covid-19 within a few months there are multiple vaccines around the world why it uh, why it was made possible because of the meta genomics uh, it is extremely rapid mm, it helps us identify the genome sequencing of the virus when the when we know that a certain person has been infected we can take a virus from the person the infected samples and we can actually see how to fight against the slider Uh, the good part of is that the entire world not just india multiple countries have come together and have shared the data about the genome sequencing of virus allowing us to make sure that we can learn from each uh, each other uh, these are happened with the covid-19 crisis as well uh, around the world scientists actually discovered their own idea of the genome sequencing of the covid-19 virus uh, they shared it with each other and on a shared directory that is how genome sequencing of covid-19 has has found out so easily they are a very popular online portal called covid assay uh, this is where multiple countries and their scientists worked together uh, to find out the sars covid 19 sequencing data uh, countries around the world including india worked together they put their scientists on the job to do this and india has also done the same now this is not just about the covid 19 fighting against the disease in the future also depending on how quickly can you find out their genome sequencing this uh, exists even today for example um, uh, the eyes of the world scientist is now uh, focused on even influenza there has been a recent outbreak of this version as well in 2022 Uh, because not many people no, uh, got infected uh, uh, infected by it people did not uh, really have noticed uh, but it was also become around the world scientists have been able to apply the genome sequencing technologies to new disease as well so it is a breakthrough moment uh, that after covid-19 many other viruses are now been detected and their genome sequencing has been related um, just because of their particular technique of genome sequencing this is an infographics to make you understand how the process actually works from taking a bacterial cell from the um, making sure that in bacterial cell you realize the dna purify that is a dna cut in it into a short segment then multiply it so it increases in number then you start to identify what exactly is the sequencing of this dna this brings up the end of the session um, for the hindu news analysis uh, let us see the um, mains practice questions for today what are the ethical concerns related to the idea of instant justice for uh, society's gratification uh, answer it in 250 words in the comment section uh, second question is single access approach 
taken by Indian law leads to a large population being deprived of this right in India. Rights in India. Do you agree? Elaborate it in 250 words for 15 mark. Post your uh, kindly post your um, answers in the comment section. Uh, uh, thanks for watching.